Perfect. Perfect. It's early Sunday morning. It's about 9.30 a.m. Dressed, ready to get started with my day. I was not productive yesterday, so I feel like today is my day to get some shit done, go run some errands and stuff like that. So it's a little chilly today. That's why I got my sweater and stuff on. But, you know, I got dressed and I realized, like, I don't have any, like, good fall boots, good casual shoes, not even a good sneaker to throw on. Um, so I'm about to, I want to go to DSW, but they're not open yet. They don't open till 11. So I'm going to swing by Target and see if I can pick up something for like right now because I'm out and I got my toes out. I don't really have no shoes to put on. Um, so I need to go pick up some shoes. But what do we need to do today? So I want to go get the paint from my room downstairs, the guest room. I did decide on this color. See, it looks so, it looks so bright on this camera, but this the color i'm going with in person like it don't even look that like whatever but this is the color that i'm going with so i gotta go pick up some of this and a paint roller paint supplies stuff like that uh what else do i want to do i have no idea i i never know what i want to do i do need to go to the grocery store per usual i always gotta go to the grocery store pick up a couple of things and you know we just gonna go with the flow see what happens see where the wind blows and where it takes us so first stop is to target so that's where i'm going right now i love coming out shopping um sunday mornings because nobody be out it'd be nice and empty you can get in and do what you need to do but sunday afternoon after people get out of church you can forget about it so yeah that's why i'm up so damn early you want to hit the stores as soon as they open because i like to be boom boom bam in and out Nobody got time to be in there with them slow shoppers. With them shoppers that be in the way of my patience is little. So, Target, here we come. Especially if we can just find some little cheap. See, maybe something like this will work. I just, I really just need something to throw on. So let's see if we can find our size. Ooh. And I don't have an eight and a half nor a nine. Dang it. Thank you, Zlat. They are, this kind of sucks, yo. Now I know I can't fit an eight, but. I'm gonna try. All right, that didn't work out. So I'm just gonna go shop regular. Okay, well that was a fail. Um, see, I mean, I tried the boots on that was a size eight. They did fit. But, you know, I didn't have on socks. So, if I had on socks, they probably would have not fit. Uh, but, I need some shoes to wear right now. And, you know what? I don't like, like, so, like, the boots were short. So, I don't like the, the space that you see between, like, jean and boot. Like, I don't want that little bit of my ankle exposed. It's, it just don't work for me. So, um, yeah, it was a no on those. So, I'm about to go. I'm going to Home Depot. Let me get over in this lane. Uh, I'm about to go to Home Depot and get this paint. And then I'm going to try to wait for DSW to open to see. Shit, at that point, I'll be done running my errands. My toes will be cold and I'll be back home. So it's like, what's the point? All right, that was nice and quick. Went in, got my paint. See, that's the beauty of shopping Sunday mornings because nobody is in there. From what I've been hearing, word in these vegan streets is Aldi has a lot more vegan plant-based options um i knew they had some before and i've bought some from there and they actually been pretty decent like their little chicken nuggets and stuff um are actually pretty good so uh i think i'm gonna swing by over there like and this is like vegan on a budget 
you know aldi is a more affordable grocery store which i am here for yeah i'm gonna go to aldi that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go to the grocery store right now vegan mozzarella we have some vegan stuff in here as you can see they have a veggie burger they have that's not vegan see the difference it doesn't say vegan on it versus actually saying vegan uh an asian burger oh oh the meatballs i've had these before they're pretty good actually mm, oh i like these these are good we got a kale burger a quinoa crunch where is the nuggets see they got the tenders but they all the way in the back oh shit okay they're all the way in the back Ooh, i don't want to open it all right there we go okay so my local audi didn't have as much stuff as i was hoping it would have let me show you some of the products that you may be able to find at your local aldi um but i was unsuccessful in finding them at mine okay so there is a vegan box mac and cheese if that's your thing they aldi sells that they also have dumplings couldn't find those but you know i would have liked to have tried those a vegan chocolate cake i did not see that either but you know your local aldi might have this in stock so check that out sesame ginger tofu cubes would have liked to have found those not at my store though oh i didn't even hit up the ice cream section i forgot to go look at this but look they have vegan strawberry cold brew and vanilla cookie chip ice cream so yeah if you all are able are able to find these and pick these up let me know what those are like but yeah those are some of the other products that you can find uh in your local aldi I just don't feel like driving to another Aldi to see if they got those products, but. So yeah, I'm happy to see that um, Aldi is, you know, starting to offer more vegan options, more vegan, uh, you know, meatless alternatives. Um, but yeah, I'm about to go drop this food off at home and then I need to go to Best Buy. Um, and then I've given up on DSW, I'm not even going there. But I wanna go to Best Buy and then I'm gonna come back home and I'm actually gonna paint that wall. That's my plan. I just stopped back home real quick to put these groceries away and I forgot that uh, I bought these flowers uh, yesterday and I was too lazy to actually cut them and put them in the vase. So I'm about to do, I'm all out of breath from going up and down the stairs. Oh, I'm out of shape. Okay, but I think I'm gonna put the food away, cut these flowers, make myself something to eat real quick, probably like a little breakfast sandwich so I can just take on the go. Head back out. So yeah, I did end up buying the chicken tenders and the chicken patties. Something quick when you just need something to eat. Don't feel like cooking. There you go. And then I also just picked up some pineapple and mango slices. stay like this as a rubber band so I always will do like this Ooh, that's kind of tight let me squeeze them together put a rubber band on put it up high so you can't see it and then boom they stay together and then put them in I'm actually gonna cut that because those are not steady And then boom <sighs> nice and simple so i'm just about to make a quick little breakfast sandwich with a bagel i'm just a i know i just talked about not really eating cheese but for this purpose i'm gonna put some cheese on this because it will be nothing without
office sandwich. <sighs> Just pair this with a little silk peach yogurt. It's almost 12 o'clock and I'm sitting here eating breakfast, but you know. So I'm just eat real quick and then I'll be right back with y'all in a minute. Okay, back on the move. Best Buy is where I'm heading to now. Where are my sunglasses? Here they are. Best Buy is where I'm about to head to now. Um, you know what I want to go find? I want to go find a steam mop um, for my floors because I don't... You know, I just use a Swiffer and the Swiffer wet pads, and I don't feel like that cleans my floor good enough. So I think I'm going to go find a steam mop. I should have looked for that when I was in Target. Damn it, I wasn't thinking. Um, find a steam mop. Go to Best Buy. And uh, where's a good place to look for a steam mop? Let me look at Target online first to see if it's worth me taking a trip up there. I got this little shark one that's $50, but is that going to be too cheap? I, don't want, I want something affordable, but I don't want the product to be cheap. Maybe I'll try that. Let me see what they have at Walmart first. Let's do some comparison to see which one is more worth my wild. Nothing actually says that it's in stock. Mm, do we want to take the chance? They have more options at uh, Walmart. Forget it. I'm just going to go to Walmart and look for a steam mop. And then I'll go to, uh, where did I say I was going? Best Buy. Best Buy and Walmart. That's where we headed to. This is what we came here for. Nice and quick. Got my product heading out. Have you ever had your nose on inside your mask? Oh, it's the grossest feeling in the world. Yo, that just happened to me. Ugh, my nose. It's like allergy season for me. <clears throat> Gross. Ew, that was nasty. Now I don't want to put my mask back on because it got snot in it. Yuck. And I don't have a backup mask in a car either. Oh, wait, yes, I do. Oh, good. Ugh, that was so nasty. I just felt it dripping inside of my mask. That was so nasty. Yuck. Sorry. Whew, okay, I got my. Sonos Wi-Fi booster for my surround sound system. You know, I swear they make these shit so you gotta buy all these extra components to make the shit work right. It's so whack. But here I go buying the shit. You know, now I'm hot with this sweater on. See, that be Atlanta weather. You wake up and it be, you wake up and it be like super cold. And now the day has progressed and it's been warmed up and it's hot. And I need to go change my clothes. I hate coming to Walmart. Walmart is a different type of crowd here. I absolutely hate it. I'm looking for some tahini. I haven't been able to find tahini in no store that I have gone to. I ended up having to put my mask back on because my other mask was all jacked up. So I am stuck with a snotty mask. But let me get my mop and get the hell up out of here. There's a shark. And a Bissell. I am leaning towards this one. I gotta go over here this way. Okay. I want to get this one. It's a vacuum mop. But see, I gotta, it takes pads though. But I don't know what I want. This is a little key kind of hard. I like the idea of this one though. That you can like sweep and vacuum all at the same time. Like you can vacuum, sweep, and mop all at once. See, then the other one I gotta sweep first and then mop. But you gotta buy little pads for this one. Or should I just get the. This is hard. I think I'm just gonna get this one. I think I'm gonna get that one. I found my tahini! I got to go packs, but I found my tahini. Oh, I'm so excited. I've been looking for this. Something told me to just check on the app to see like um, if they had it and what aisle it was in. Found my tahini. I'm happy. That made my trip worth it for coming to Walmart because I hate coming to Walmart. 
it is hot i am so hot in this sweater right now when i came out it was like in the 40s low 50s or something like that now i feel like it's like 80 degrees Whew, shoot it's hot all right let me get in the house i feel like i've been spending up all my money and you know i am not one to be out here blowing no bags i like to keep my bags in the bank so I'm gonna take my ass to the house where it's safe and you don't spend no money. Decided that I'm going to try out my steam mop. So I'm gonna, now I'm about to be in full on clean mode. So I'm about to sweep up the floors, get those mopped up, do them downstairs, do them here, do them up and down the stairs. We'll see about up and down the stairs. But I definitely need to do the main level floors because these floors are dirty and the floors downstairs are dirty too. So I'm gonna do that right now. So let me get to, let me change first and then let me get to cleaning. First you gotta have music when you clean up. Living for weekends, wishing I could take a break from this world. Running on a hamster wheel, but searching for something I can't feel. I just wanna. muscle into it that's all it was that's what it needed okay hey i think we're in business here now where does this little scent disc little thing go the mop pad you have already blah 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 blah, blah. oh it goes in, in here oh okay i see i see let's see how this works i don't think i got the pad on right Is this cleaning something? Mm -hmm. Let me fix this pad. It smells good though. Now I'm about to tackle this kitchen because it's oh, it's a little messy. Tight. A little hungry too. And then I need to wipe down these tables over here. Wipe down this table over here. Clean off my desk because uh, an explosion has happened over here. But yeah, it's this week. I work to do, honey. What time is it? 4.30. I don't know if I'm going to get to painting downstairs um 
we'll see how it goes right now it's looking like a no-go um that might have to be a next weekend activity but I'm about to finish steam mopping clean this kitchen up real quick later that same evening hey i i ain't forget about y'all i was steam mopping the whole place well i didn't do my oh make me bright i didn't do the whole place i did the first floor the main living area steam mopped the whole thing i'm tired but i'm about to run to the grocery store because i've been craving some peanut butter so i'm going to get some peanut butter and some avocados so i'm just about to head over there oh about to get dark light again so yeah just about to head over there and come back and figure out what i'm gonna eat for dinner i'm hot i am so tired i feel like when i when i finally get in the bed i am gonna fall out I'm gonna fall out later. All right, that was just a quick trip with a couple bags. I was supposed to get two things. Oh, I forgot to get the avocado. See, I was in the store like, ooh, ooh. I didn't even grab a card, didn't grab a basket. I'm like, whatever, I'm carrying it in my hand because I was focused. Bread and peanut butter. And I wanted to get avocado, I forgot. But I got the bread and the peanut butter and then I ended up getting some extra stuff. So I'm about to make some quick dinner. When I mean quick, that chicken patty that I bought earlier from Aldi is about to get eaten. And I'll probably just slice up some potatoes, make some little homemade fries in the air fryer. I really need a vegetable to go with this, but I'm going to nix the vegetables this time. I'm going to just call it a day. That's just going to be my dinner. It is what it is. I need something quick because I am tired. Okay. Throw this in the air fryer with my potatoes. Chop up some potato for some fries. I love potatoes. I could eat potatoes with every meal. I remember somebody commented on one of my videos, a couple of my videos, and said, <laughs> talking, you know, shit about me eating french fries all the time or eating carbs that's what it was eating carbs all the time i'm like look honey i don't know what problem you got with carbs but me and carbs are friends okay we get along just fine okay i don't know why people be so pressed about what other people eat or what other people do how does it affect your life you gotta ask yourself does this affect my life and if the answer is no then you know what you should do Worry about yourself. Worry about yourself. Just, you know, figure out how to make your life better. Figure out how to be great. Because that's all we should be trying to do at the end of the day is be great. I know that's what I'll be over here trying to do. Trying to figure out how to be amazing. Okay? So usually when I like to do my potatoes, is I throw them in there like that. My seasonings I like to use. I like to use garlic. I like to use paprika and then a little seasoning salt and some oil. Oh, I need some pepper too. And a little pepper. So all I do is drizzle that up. A little shake, shake, shake. Another shake, shake, shake. You can go a little heavy on the garlic because we like garlic. And then paprika it up. Boom, 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 boom. And pepper. And then, you know, I like to, and then I just like to give that a little mix. Let's see, my seasoning then fell off, so we're going to go back in with another round. And now we can get another mix. 
and that's it just something a little light put them on my pan which my pan need to be cleaned i told y'all in my apartment tour video that everything be separate over in these parts so my little stuff be labeled you see that yeah you know it's a little dirty it didn't been through it a little bit but vegan only vegan only dishes pots pans vegan only so i just put that on there do, 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 do. i'm gonna pop these in the oven probably midway through when these is done i'll put my chicken patty in Okay, never mind the whole wrinkled t-shirt change. I jumped in the shower. I was like, you know, I might as well just go jump in the shower, you know, get ready for bed. And yeah, I was in there a little bit too long and my fries didn't stop, so. So let me go ahead and make this. Now that, uh, now that I took all that time, I'm gonna make it quick. I'm, I'm gonna put it in the microwave. Can I do it on the stove top? Yeah, I'm gonna do it on the stove. Oh yeah, they look done. Let me taste one. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's good. Seasoned up just nicely. Okay, I decided to make some vegan ranch. So you just start with, um, and I'll put the recipe down below because I don't measure, I just, you know, do my thing. But this says vegan mayo, and then I got a little bit of non-dairy milk. I had almond, so I use almond. You can use soy, whatever you got. Garlic powder. I just sprinkle it until I feel like it's enough. Onion powder. Same. Parsley. I know y'all can't see none of this. I'll show it to you when I get finished. So, parsley. And then a little hint of apple cider vinegar to give it that twang. Yeah, I just do about a little cap for this much. Because, you know, vinegar is strong. And can we see? That's what it looks like pre-mix. All right, we're just going to mix. She's all mixed. There's my vegan ranch. All right, my little patty is done. This is like, this is a for real meal on the budget, like a single person's meal. <laughs> this is an unmarried person's meal. This is a I'm just eating to survive meal. This is a ain't nobody got time for cooking type of meal. This is like fast food homemade fast food. <laughs> Actually gonna have some pineapples. Pineapples as my dessert. With some tahini. Here's my sad little junior meal. <laughs> Here's my little kid's meal. <laughs> that I'm about to enjoy. I'm about to eat. Y'all have a wonderful week. Thank you all for hanging out with me, and we'll do this again soon. Bye.